of all time. The person was, the victim was walking around like nothing happened. He was walking down the street. He was walking down the street like nothing was going to happen to him. But he knew that he was regret. His friends told him that there was some creature. He thought they were lying, told him it was fake. He said, it was just a myth. Don't believe it. But this is the day where he will take that back. And that is today. And that is today. And that's today. It was going while he was on the way back home, going back to his apartment, having a nice day after after having dinner. She he had the feeling that he was being watched. Every day he believe, he actually did believe his friends. He just never said never told them that he was actually believing it. But secretly, he was going to be the new victim to the new prey. He'll be the next victim. He, so when he went to his apartment, he could just have the feeling like Every day, he was being followed, taken, somewhere that he can't understand. He always had that feeling like he was being watched, or some sorts. He could just have the feeling like he was being watched. Always had that feeling. Every day he'd had that feeling of him being watched. Every day. Every day that went past. He would believe his friends, but he never told them. There is a reason. Because he didn't want his friends to think that they were telling the truth. He did because he read the news, saying that there was many deaths in the past. But when he looked out his window, he saw the fate. His fate. He saw that there was something right outside his window, looking at him through the distance of the trees. But the thick, blue, giant mass of destruction the giant blast of destruction The giant blast of destruction was still in the way. He drove in his car. He was getting a new... He was going on vacation. But he still, after when he was in his hotel room, he still thought he was being followed. After his vacation, he still thought he was being followed. By not someone. Something. By not someone. Something. By not someone. Something. Someone who wasn't their friends to make them think. It wasn't their friends. It was something else. 
something that followed him. Everywhere he went, he always had that thing following him. Everywhere. No matter where he go, it was there. Wherever he left, it was there. Wherever he went to, it was there. He couldn't stand it anymore. He wanted it to leave him alone. But then, when the day, when the final day of the week came, on Sunday, he was reported missing. He was at his, the last thing was at his home. He recorded a video saying, don't come find me. Because it was already found me. And you know what it is. It's that dragon. Don't come and find me. Don't, 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 don't. Those were his last words. And those were his last words. And those were his last words. And those were all the words he had. Until the tape ended with a giant roar and bash of glass and walls and falling over trees. The crickle. The police investigated, finding nothing but dust and hollows. But there was one thing they found. It was a gun. To, to blast that thing headshotted, but he wasn't able to do it in time. He thought he was able to do it. He thought it was done. Okay. It was all an illusion to make you think. But it wasn't. He saw the eyes.